It's been difficult to miss the blossoming career of Bangor graduate Hamza Yassin. Hamza Yassin is a wildlife cameraman, photographer, conservationist and television presenter. He graduated from this university with a degree in zoology with conservation in 2011. In 2020, he presented the Channel 4 documentary Scotland, My Life in the Wild, where he showcased the incredible wildlife and landscapes of his home on the Ardnamurchan Peninsula in the west coast of Scotland. Hamza has been generously giving back to his alma mater. He's been back lecturing our second year students in conservation practice and our students emerge from his lectures with a re really inspired and they take away the message of the real hard work needed to make luck happen. So Vice-Chancellor for his outstanding contribution um, to popular entertainment, it gives me great pleasure to present to you for the honorary degree of Master of Science and Fellowship of the University, Hamza Yassin. Oh, wow. Thank you. Uh, thank you so much, Professor Julia Jones, for the kind words that you said about me. Ladies and gentlemen, Vice-Chancellor, fellow colleagues, it's been an absolute pleasure being here. Never in a million years did I think I'd be standing up here and accepting this award. Following in the footsteps of countless amazing people and people that I look up to, Sir David Attenborough, who also received a degree here from Bangor University. Let me start off by saying how grateful I am to be speaking to every single one of you. I want to take this opportunity and thank Bangor University, especially my lecturers, my professors, my colleagues, and finally, my parents. Let me give you a little background information about how I came to study zoology with conservation here at this amazing university. My parents migrated from Sudan to the United Kingdom after being invited by the Royal College of Medicine. Coming from a long line of dentists, doctors and GPs, I hesitantly followed my siblings and went down the dentistry route. I managed to apply to dentistry, get in, and I was like, yes my parents are going to be proud of me. Four months before I started my dentistry career, I had second thoughts. I only chose this because that's what I thought my family wanted me to do. I managed to pluck up the courage and speak to my parents. Luckily, they were very understanding and they'll said they'll support whatever decision I take. So armed with this knowledge, I was like, I want to work with animals and I want to be a wildlife cameraman and I heard that I needed a zoology degree to be taken seriously. You should have seen the look on their faces. I visited two other universities before arriving to Bangor University, and immediately I knew this place was for me. I didn't know why. Something deep inside of me said I'd regret it if, if I didn't pick Bangor University. And to top it off, I heard that the university was very well known and had a supportive dyslexia department. And as a lifelong member of the Dyslexia Club, I'd be a fool not to accept their help. I will, I will always treasure the time I had here in the university and the stuff that I learned from my lecturers, my practicals and the wonderful field trips we had. I couldn't wait to see what each module brought and the new information I was going to learn about the natural world. Fast forward three years, and I remember sitting in this amazing hall, exactly where you guys are now, and I'm thinking, what on earth am I going to do with my degree? The American choreographer, Andre de Shields, gave three bits of advice that I think bear repeating. One, surround yourself with people whose eyes light up when they see you coming. Two, Slowly is the fastest way to get to where you want to be. And three, the top of one mountain is the bottom of the next, so keep climbing. I achieved my first goal in life, which is to work in natural history, and I've made my work. But mark my words, this is not my only life ambition. 
I hope that together we can take this world to a better place for our future generations. Bangor University has given me, and I'm sure all of you, the biggest leg up in life. But it's your turn now. Go out there, make a difference in whatever field you choose. Do it to the best of your ability. The road will be long and it won't be easy and sometimes it will be very challenging. But if you persevere, you will reap the rewards. Last but not least, seeing as I'm giving advice, I encourage you all to develop your communication skills because once you open your mouth, you will tell the world who you are. Make a good first and lasting impression of yourselves and this amazing university. I followed my dream and I hope you follow yours. So go out there and change the world. Dior Kumbaur.